What's the road ahead for regionals? We've got our very own David Hollerth here with us in studio. Hey, David. Hey, Brad. Yeah, so uh, to your point, credit is the biggest concern for investors right now. And looking through to the end of the year, it seems like, uh, you know, the story there uh, is that the office area of commercial real estate is obviously an area that has structural weakness. And um, what banks are doing is they're setting aside a lot of money to prepare for potential losses. And the big thing there is whether or not they can predict the losses. So that's that's really defines uh, how much uh, fear could be in store for regional banks or not at all uh, going out through the end of this year. So that's really where investors should focus on. David, what do you make of the sentiment right now? I know you've been talking with a number of analysts, a number of investors here over the last several months. What sticks out to you just in terms of where we've seen the biggest pivots and why people are maybe a lot more confident in where we are today, despite the trouble with NYCB versus where we were a year ago? Right, yeah, I, I mean, I think you gotta highlight how unique NYCB's situation was. And as far as like how exposed they were to commercial real estate loans, specifically those in New York, uh, that have pretty specific problems. You know, they're uh, very much an outlier. That being said, we did say that about the banks last year. Um, but you know, I've, I'm not hearing from regulators or bank executives that they're feeling at all like this is any kind of systemic thing at this point. Which is the big difference between the last year. Where I think there was so much fear, and you know, just the idea of a bank failure. It wasn't really in the lexicon for finance or just people in the U.S. in general. And, you know, that, that had been a 10-year thing where we hadn't seen such a large bank failure. So I think it's kind of dealing with that. But it's, generally, it seems like this is more idiosyncratic, as they say.